Welcome back to our Frost DK Zero to Hero ASM challenge. Now I have some bad news. So when I was exporting episode nine, which I recorded on Thursday, um, I hit the export button. Uh, I get up, walk away, because it takes you know five to ten minutes. Come back, it looks like it exports, but then it won't play past like 18 minutes. So that's weird. Find out my hard drive space filled up while I was exporting. Okay, no big deal. So I go into my OBS exports folder for saved videos where I record everything basically. And on Thursday I recorded two videos, episode 9 and episode 10, back to back. So. I had episode 9 done, edited, all that stuff, and episode 10 was still in that OBS folder, like, not touched, just sitting and uh, waiting. And then I'm like, oh, I'll just delete all these recordings in this OBS folder because they're all done and edited, because I had just finished episode 9. Uh, long story short, episode 10 has been deleted, so yeah, I've gained some I.O. Uh, off camera, on camera, but it's been wiped. So I was able to do... Raider IO is down, so I can't check on... in a browser, but... Uh, I think I did... plus 10 SBG... and... I think I did this plus 9... Quarter, or not quarter stars. No good offensive. So at the end of episode 9, we were at 11.46. Episode 10 took us to 12.14, but unfortunately I have deleted that. And I even tried to recover it with like data recovery software and it did to no avail. So it is what it is. I did SBG, no code. Plus 2 to SBG, plus 3 to... Or 3 chested to no code, so... It is what it is. Doesn't matter. Well, it does matter, but we're. This is the new episode 10. So this is Saturday morning. So it'll be a nice, chill day. We're still on Tyrannical. Um, I think the strategy here is just work up whatever dungeon falls at the bottom. We're just gonna do it and push it, you know, close to the top. So we're going to try some AV, HOV, and maybe uh, Ruby Life Pools, depending on how long the first two take. I am sitting on a Catalyst uh, currency. I don't know what they call them. Catalyst charge. But I'm waiting my shoulders and my chest... I might just do it on my legs because they are upgradable. My shoulders are not upgradable. Chest still isn't upgradable. But some because it's from Raid Finder. And yeah, because I have a bunch of Valor as well. 4,800. Um, yeah, so we're at 382. Probably after I run these dungeons, I'll catalyze something. Hopefully I get some shoulders that I can upgrade. Catalyze the shoulders and just use a bunch of valor and upgrade uh, my lowest piece, which is my my boots. I think yeah, my boots or my shoulders, depending. Whatever. I'm just rambling. Big surprise. Let's go find an Azure Vault, shall we? Okay. Um, it was taking a minute. There weren't a lot of groups in the 7 to 11 range, so I have a plus 9 Halls of Valor, so I just hosted my own key. And we got a juicy group. So, because of the uncapped Valor, you know, all the pumpers are down in the low levels. So, I will do a group check, or I'll show you guys the group once we um, get to the dungeon here. Okay, we are in the dungeon. Our tank. Uh, 2400. DPS, uh, what is this guy? Priest. 
2300 DPS, 2600 healer, shaman, 1700, and our healer is a thousand. So this will be a pretty easy run. All right, we're on the first boss already. Um, less less than a minute. That seems insane. That was a bad shield. Yeah, this is a crazy week. This is definitely the week to host your own keys and just bring bring the big boys. Oh shit, I got hit by that. So this group is absolutely pumping. This will be probably my fastest Halls of Valor run in history. We're on the second boss, Herja. Where is the bubble? Oh, wait. This is the new strat. Tried to dodge everyone with that thing. Trying to do some death strikes. Oh, sorry, bro. Alright, that wasn't so bad. Lost the healer on the uh, bubble, I think. So we're pulling the wolves right into Fenrir, because this tank is out of control. Run away! What? Again? Okay, Fenrir is toasted. 
And we're off to... We're at 82%. I think we need 84 to the last boss. We have the two guards at the door, and then we're off to the last boss. God King Scovald Chump doesn't even know he's about to get smoked. Uh, this group has been great. No complaints. And I, I thank I thank the players for the carry. Find shield. Shield. I almost didn't get the shield. Druid is taking a lot of damage. Shield? Okay. I think that... Uh, was the shield on the ground? I didn't even notice. Maybe the tank wasn't paying attention. But we got it, so that's all that matters. And now we're on to Odin. And should be able to three chest this. I don't think this is going to be a three minute fight. We just beat Scovald in a minute and 30, so. Easy run, easy plus nine should take us to, like give us like 40 points maybe we'll see Did I get the interrupt on that? I think so. Front left. Get out of the way! Oh. Dang, we smoked that guy. Oh, my key went all the way to a Ruby Life Pulse 12. That's crazy. But we got our bonus Valor. Everyone's happy. Ooh, I got a helmet. That I don't need. Looks cool, though. Hold on. Oh! Got some pants? Oh heck yeah. Upgrade those babies. Wait, is that what I just got? Yeah. Legs. Cool. Alright, back to Val Draken. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna host another key because that was great. That was easy. I mean, I'm getting carried, so it's no surprise. But you know what? Everyone's valor is uncapped. Everyone has the chance to get carried, so part of the game, I suppose, at this point. 
Should I host a Ruby Life Pools plus 12 with the bonus Valor in the title? Oh. Is plus 12... Can I get carried through plus 12? That will take us for sure to 1300. Right? Let's see what happens. I'll put it up and we'll see. So no one wanted to join my plus 12 ruby life pool, so I downgraded it to a plus 11. Still nobody wanted to join, so I just found a plus 9 Azure Vault, which is what we're looking for. Because Azure Vault is our lowest key right now. Hopefully we can, you know, one chest this. This timer is always tight. I'm um, just waiting for a healer, so we'll do a group check once we get to the dungeon. We made it to the dungeon. Um, our tank is 1188. Our warlock, 1302. Another demon hunter, DPS. Um, 2000. I don't know if that's for tank or DPS. Both the icons are in the same spot. So, And then our healer is 1100. So right now they're just discussing skipping the second boss. I'm not sure. I think what he when, when they say skip, I think they mean do what he's saying is do all the whelps. So I think that's when you do all that extra tra trash and then you jump down from the ring do the third the third boss and the last boss and then maybe you come back for the second one not 100 percent sure to be honest but we'll see how it goes all right we made it to the first boss uh we had one wipe but that's just because um we had pulled uh I think one of the DPS accidentally pulled an extra pack of um, whelps. So, but we did clear all the trash up there. So um, I think we're going to do this uh, skip. We'll see how it goes. When we get there. Yeah, this boss is pretty easy if we just... Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. We just get all the trees. <laughs> I think we got them all. Yeah, I couldn't tell where my teammates were there for a second. been defeated so we're at the second boss I'm not sure I think they when they say second boss skip I think we jump down after this so I think that's what that means Thank you. 
Which I've seen that skip before. I think it's to... So you don't have to do the frogs. But are the frogs that bad? I don't know. Oh boy. Yeah, this is a tough fight to heal, I'll tell you that. Hoping we could avoid a second phase of this. Okay, second boss. I guess we have to go back and jump down. And... Oh, we walk along the side. Got it. I've seen this before. Okay, that's not so bad. Puts us at 100. That's got to be way faster than doing those frogs. Third boss.
find shelter. And down to the dragon, that route seems way better than doing the frogs. Because we still have nine minutes to kill this thing. Oh, they can get that one. That's fine. Sweet. With time to spare. Oh, we almost two chests. Uh, plus 40. Alright, so after the Azure Vault with the little skip after the um, second boss, which we one chested it, so I don't know if it's actually faster than the frogs, but I liked it. Nice change of pace. Um, we got the plus nine Azure Vault, and earlier we did the uh, plus nine Halls of Valor, which I hosted. <clears throat> Excuse me. Which I hosted my own key, I got a bunch of pumpers, and they carried me. And we three chested the Halls of Valor, so. We are super close to 1300. Um, I'm just gonna call it here. Just two dungeons on this one, and then maybe. In the next video, I can do three dungeons and get to um, 1400. Because I'll jump into 1300 super easy, and then I should be able to do two more and make it to four uh, 14. Um, so that's seven because the lost episode 10 that I accidentally deleted, I did two there. So we are up to seven out of eight on the week. Looking at a 398. A 395 and then probably a 395 again 
I haven't done any raiding. Um, maybe try and get into a normal pug or see if my guild is doing that raid tonight. The normal run. Um, I have a bunch of valor. I have some catalyst charges. So I think I didn't get any shoulders yet. I think I'm going to upgrade some gear. Do the time walking for the cash. The weekly quest and um yeah, just try and get some upgrades going and then we'll pump us up into maybe three mid to high 380s and then once we start doing 11s and 12s we'll be able to craft the weapon and the lariat and that should push us into the 390s hopefully and yeah that's a wrap that is the end of episode 11 um see you guys in the next one